going to download Wild ID. Get a Mac here. It's 220 megs. Tried over here on a yesterday on a actually a Wi-Fi and it went a good bit and crapped out and then it did it again. Here I'm on a hard wire. So I'm going to grab this, drag it to applications. This has got El Capitan. Let's go ahead and see if we can run this thing. Finder. New Finder window. Applications. Wild ID. Yeah, let's open it. Here it is down here. And I don't see anything yet. Already drugged this to applications. Ooh! I gotta register it, so I'm gonna stop here and let me hit register later. Create a new project. I know nothing about this program. Want to use it for turtles. About wild ID. Point nine, point two four. This is the identify patterns in animals. So I was going to try this on the box turtles. File, edit. Plug in. So I'm going to try this program um, on turtle patterns. And I think this is to share different animals with the public. I was just trying to do them, the one around here. Let's look at parentheses. English. Bionomal nomenclature for species. Common name. Default group time interval. I have no idea. File. Check for updates. There are updates. Weird. Which are later. Your version's up to date. Hmm. So I downloaded that from Conversation International Wild ID. So I'm going to go ahead and later on try to fool with this program. Search animal. Genus and species. The text looks boogered up. Let's put today's date in there. Let's put the beginning of the month, end date. Let's put the end of the month. Search. Found zero images. Animal. Search images. Help. Online help. Here, what is Wild ID? Software derived open source platform. Managing camera trap projects.
internet. Managing plugins. Okay, managing plugins. Let's see what that does. Install plugin. Restart. Well, that was quick. Almost too quick. Plugin. Now it's got Team Network. Sync with Team. I think it's when you want to share the group of animals you're looking at with another group. Okay. Plug in. So that didn't appear before. Help. Online help. Export view. So I'm going to go ahead and create a project later on of the box turtles probably and play with this thing but this is wild ID sounds like a cool tool sampling events What I'm going to do here, I'm going to go over here and export that page as a PDF. Desktop, Wild ID program, and I'm going to save that page so I can look at this offline. You how to load images. Here you go. So we'll open a new window in the mainframe to load image deployment information. You must use a selection to pull down menu for the sampling event. Okay. New projects. I haven't created a project yet. This is Carlos Test. Create new project. Okay, abbreviation. Okay. Ba 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 ba. Four four four. Create new project. Ooh. Now since I've done that, it's got organizations, personnel, camera management. Oh, this is totally cool. Camera manufacturer. Browning Bushnell. Boy, this sounds like all captures in for wild game. Look at this. This is really wild. Browning Bushnell Covenant Cuddly Hunting Lipwood. They make scopes. So I guess mostly this is for wild animals that are used long range. Because that's what this is for. The thing here, they've been using this, I think, on... Um, Giraffes and stuff, camera traps, sample defaults. Your purchased serial number, create camera. Okay, let's just make the serial number be all seven. Create camera. Your purchased. Okay, now how do you stick an image in there? File, annotate images, edit, view, import data same window parent tree node with navigation tree I'm not mr. software so what I have to do is I have to basically um, screw around with this before I play with this he's got the lat long so I think this is used to where you want to take a lat long of your image so others can see where it was uh, identified Well, 
this is great. Here's the license. Public license. Free weather. Once I get using this, I'll probably show something that's more benefit. Here, expert data. Excel. View. Edit. How do you import? Plug in. Create camera. Test. The organizations. Personnel. Boy, this is really rich with inputs. So it's designed to share information with other researchers. Create a camera trap. Upload, bulk upload camera traps and CSV file. Export. Boy, this is cool. It's cool to get a new program. Okay, here's the research paper by Cross et al. 2014 box turtles pattern recognition software on eastern box turtles over here they've got the patterns they mention using wild ID right here so that's where I got the idea from actually I was looking at facial recognition software this is in herpetological whatever review I butchered the name 2014 talks about using bands PIT tags and I've noticed from my research that the uh, putting marks on the edge here tends to get goofed up get eaten away so I've been looking at this pattern and discovered the wild program here ID so later on I'm going to try to use a wild ID with the local box turtles I've been cataloging uh, just to see how it works how you put the results online this paper is called Cross et al 2014 if you want to google it pattern recognition software thousand ninety four thousand ninety four here after after eating the bananas and stuff put her back and see if it goes into the hole oh it's not going to go down in the hole and move the banana back and there's more room Okay, I revised my logbook. I erased it, which I don't like to normally do, but this is before eating, the slash marks after eating. I've done that every blue moon, haven't done it on here. Here's last August. You should try to weigh it at least once a month just out of curiosity.